Estrados, Yamanashi Prefecture and Shizuoka Prefecture. We are coming to the north side, Mount Fuji north side. So this area is countryside. You see a lot of agricultural land in this area. In Tokyo, you don't see so much agricultural land, but we are now coming countryside. A lot of agricultural land, such as rice paddy fields are located. And we are now coming to Yamanashi Prefecture. This Yamanashi Prefecture is located in a big basin. A lot of orchards to produce fruits, such as peach and grape are located. And also a lot of winery are located in this Yamanashi Prefecture. And maybe while you are in Japan, you will find Japanese people say hi, hi, very often because hi basically means yes, but hi doesn't necessarily mean yes. We say hi, hi when we are listening to other people as a form of acknowledgement. And you will find Japanese people say hi, hi very often. And also you will notice Japanese people bow very often. It's true, we have a very kind of bow. By very kind of bow, we express our appreciation and respect and apology. For example, we have a very casual bow. And so, and this casual bow, just, just to say hello, it's a casual bow. We also have a very polite bow. We call it 45 degrees bow, 45 because Bex Anchor is supposed to become 45 degrees. It's a very polite bow. Probably people at your hotel will bow to you very elegantly and very politely at 45 degrees bow. Uh, several years ago, when chairman of Toyota Motor Company had to apologize regarding recall of Toyota Motor Cars, he apologized at 60, 60 degrees bow. But later by media, he was criticized in that his bow should be deeper. <laughs> <laughs> So this area is a countryside, you will see a lot of the ordinary people's houses and two-storied house is a very popular two-storied house. Many Japanese people have a strong desire to own their own home. The home ownership rate is more than 60%. This figure is higher than other countries. And when we purchase a house, we usually pay 10% to 25% as a down payment. For the rest, we request a loan from our bank. And usually it takes about 25 to 35 years to repay all the loan. Today, interest rate is low today. Interest rate is less than 2%. So today, interest rate is low today. Available to prepare. <laughs> So, by the way, many people say Japanese people's gestures are a little bit different from yours. So, sometimes a little bit misleading, a little bit confusing for foreign visitors. Some people told me, in order to avoid misunderstanding between you and us, I show you typical Japanese people's gestures. Please remember, typical Japanese people's gestures. For example, we call people by gesturing like this. People in many countries call people by gesturing like this. But in Japan, we call people by gesturing like this. So this gesture doesn't mean go away. This gesture means come on, come on, come on. And this gesture means me. This gesture means you, me and you. This gesture doesn't mean no, just me and you. This gesture means yes, this gesture means no. Probably this gesture is universal, same as yours. Yes and no. Also, this gesture means no in Japan, no. As this gesture means no, this gesture doesn't mean you smell, just no in Japan, no, no. And this gesture means and peace and happy. So this gesture means peace and happy. So many people pose like this when they take photo. This gesture means peace and happy. This gesture means okay, okay. But if I put like this, and this gesture suggests money. 
in Japan. This gesture suggests money. If I put like this, this gesture means let's have a drink. Many people like to go drinking after work. They think they can communicate better while drinking. This gesture means let's have a drink. And this gesture means you are fired in Japan. This gesture means you are fired. This gesture means angry, very angry. And this gesture means girlfriend, not wife. Girlfriend, girlfriend. So do you catch Japanese people's gestures? And I show you some example. And if my husband has a girlfriend, maybe I'll get angry. <laughs> he will be fired by me. But if he gives me money, uh, it's okay like this. <laughs> So soon, and in the front, you begin to see some roller coasters, roller coasters, roller coasters. And so we are coming at the foot of Mount Fuji, but Mount Fuji this way, Mount Fuji, and on the left. Now, cloudy, we don't just see Mount Fuji now, Mount Fuji direction is on the left, but now, and cloudy, and we and we don't see Mount Fuji now. Mount Fuji stands on the left. Mount Fuji is a very big mountain, but it's not cloudy. We don't see it now. And soon, on the left, they will drive by a popular amusement park, Fujiku Highland. So roller coasters there are very popular. Yes, Fujiku Highland.